had friends over whenever we could, and someone's putting up a fence, as you can hear. So yeah, I'm going to start this again in three, two, one. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Wait, before I start, guys, I better stop the music because copyright. Hey Siri, stop. Hey guys, what is going on? It's your boy Louisie21. I'm back and I'm boiling under here. It's like a, a greenhouse. How are you doing, guys? It's been so long. I'm back. Glad to be back. Got so many stories. Like, it's been amazing at Amsterdam. Um, just chilling here with the heat. You know, living that summer life. Oh, literally, I'm feeling so good. It might just be the weather, probably, but in general, I'm just feeling good about life. And uh, someone's putting up a fence, so we're just gonna roll with it. And I want to chat and uh, try and ignore the guy killing or putting up a fence, whatever he's doing. Or he's smashing a bit of wood. Like, what else do people do in the summer? Anyway, back to the video um, or whatever this is. Like, um, I did a vlog in Amsterdam, so you know how lit that was. Obviously, I couldn't film everything we did. Well, we went to the, um, the sex museum, and uh, that's overrated. It's just awkward as hell. So jokes. But yeah, I've got to go back, for sure. Absolutely can't beat it, like... It's different, way different to here, like, here there's a stigma around drugs and all that, and like, always oh, bad, but there it's just legal, so it's just another day, like, there's nothing wrong with it there, here it's just stigmatised and comes with violence, well, I mean, it's associated, associated with violence, but it shouldn't be, because there everyone was so chill, but not much crime happens there in terms of drug related stuff because you're allowed to to do what you want essentially and yeah I didn't end up in the canal though we had to park near it literally next to it so the van could have ended up in the canal just good banter you know the amount of tourists but uh, you know we were treated well for the most part you know I'm not going to go into the negative stuff because like some people just dickheads what do you want? You get them all over the world. You know, and we get them here too, so. And then one day we just saw like, what, like, two homeless people fighting over rubbish or recycling. Because I think they're like, or in a lot of countries, you get money for trading in recycling, for recycling stuff, I don't know. So I think like the homeless people collect all the rubbish and get money for it. But these two were fighting because the other one went near his bin. And you don't mess with a homeless man's bin, I guess. I don't know, maybe he lived in the bin. Yeah, I'm not going to go into it, but that's just one of the crazy stories. And the bloody cyclists, don't get me started, they almost killed me. I was stuck between cyclists and a tram coming towards me. I almost died. Like, either a cyclist, a tram or the canal was going to kill me. It didn't, I'm here, I'm alive. And it was a good trip, seven hour trip to get there, you know. About that, seven hours home. We got home pretty quickly. And we had family here waiting, over from Italy as always. There's always someone in my house. So we came back to a full house. Couldn't relax, you know. Like, it was great, but still, it was just too much. <laughs> Too much to process. Then Saturday was the Champions League final, or that Saturday, because we got back on the Friday. So yeah, Champions League final, I was supporting Inter Milan. City beat them anno annoyingly. Only 1-0 though, it was a close game. So I didn't really enjoy that. 
and my cousin's husband is a Milan fan. So he was just rubbing it in. He brought me bad luck, probably. It's my Inter lost. And then my parents went away for 10 days. So we're just having parties every night. Me and my brother just, we burnt down the house. Like, got the women over, you know. What more can you do? No, we had fun, we were out almost every night. You know, have friends over when we could. It was just lit. It was just too good. And now my brother's gone off to Norway and Sweden, which are really nice places. Don't get me wrong, but like, it's probably gonna be cold there. It's probably gonna rain too. But yeah, he'll be gone for a few weeks. Then when he gets back, we're here for a few weeks. Then in August, we go to Italy. So I don't know how many holidays he's had this year. Even me, I've had like three. Because there was a Milan trip. Um, so yeah, I've been busy this year. Compared to last year, it's good. Good to get back to normal. If not above normal, like, better than normal, you know. Because it just made me realise, like, you only live once, you know. So you might as well live it. <laughs> what are you doing? Just not doing anything. Especially after how ill I was last year. Like, I'll, I'll take it. I'll, I'll take a normal life any day. Um, so yeah. Things are going good. And it's not just the weather, like. It just feels so good in general. I don't know why. And like, people around me are doing good as well. Um, so, when your friends are doing all right, and people, you, you, you know, that are important to you, all right, I'm back to the video guys, so before the battery died, I was saying, yeah, everyone's doing good. Um, another thing I want to remind you of, or a good thing that happened to me, is that I finished my um, sessions of therapy. Like, they had six, they had me down for six or seven. I think I did seven, at, um, seven sessions, and they really helped, guys. I never thought they would. I was like, nah, this is not for me. Um, you know, I'm a man, why do I want to talk about my feelings? I'm like, ugh, no. But um, yeah, best thing I ever did. And like, so that's helped a, a lot. So another thing to be proud of and uh, think reason why I'm feeling good. And you know, um, I don't know. If you ever have second thoughts, um, about that sort of thing. Don't is really useful. If you use it in the right way, you know, someone to talk to other than family or friends. Because I'm my best friends, obviously. They're my best therapists, but like, comes a point where you need to talk to like, a professional because they know the right questions to ask and the right signs to look for, for different things. It's not always a bad thing. It's part of growth, I guess. And it takes years to learn that. I'm still learning. Gotta be open to learning every day, guys. Like, whatever it is. To new experiences, like... Amsterdam, like... You, you gotta experience it. And, um... You're not gonna learn that in a book. I mean, oh yeah, I read about... I read about therapy, no. Um, until you try it, you don't know. It's like with a lot of things in life. So at a point where I just that guy's still fixing his fence. That is like unreal. Like what has that fence done to you? No, I'm just out there chilling. Living my best life. I've been saying it for a while and just fucking out. So I'm trying to be like all happy and that and like tell you how I'm feeling but this guy's at his fence, just trying to kill it. I don't know. I don't know what the fence did to him, but yeah, it is hot out here. Don't know how much longer I can be under here. Put myself through torture for you guys. Better bloody appreciate it. <laughs> but yeah, things are going good, and you know, a spider. That is no, not into spiders at all. That is not a bit of me. I keep getting distracted. 
I, I don't have ADHD, I promise. Um, don't quote me on, on like, what, what ADHD um, actually entails, but, okay. I'm popular, I'm sorry. What can I say? Do I talk to you? I'm just a cool kid, guys. Um, but yeah. Whether this video made any sense, I don't know. I just want to share how I'm feeling. Feeling good. And that is it, guys. Like, there's nothing to moan about, so it's not really good for content. Now, I've got something to moan about, it's probably easier. But yeah. Just because I'm not making videos doesn't mean I'm not living my best life. Just too busy to make videos. No, I love you guys though, and um, I should really commit to this more. Uh, this has been a, a different kind of year. And yeah, so just... I'm not promising anything. I'm not going to be like making videos every week. I might do. But yeah, we'll see. And the battery died again, guys. Just typical. Even on a good day, you know. Alright, guys. I'm gonna end it here. And the guy stopped banging on his fence. That's ideal. Perfect timing. But yeah, guys, I might do some streaming. I might. I say I might, I probably won't. Fuck's sake get a phone call. I'm going to ignore this kid because it gets on my nerves. Um, like I said, I'm so popular. Um, but yeah guys, that's really annoying. Okay, I'm going to end it here, you know, be cool, be humble, keep living life. I've said that already. Just thank you. Um, take it easy guys. Peace. It's too hot. It's too hot. <laughs>